Hi, YouTube. Welcome to Shimmer Girl Talks. Today, I'm going to talk about a topic that comes up all the time on a social media site that I like to visit. And that is, why don't men court or date anymore? And I've tackled this um, subject before. I wrote a blog about a year ago. And, you know, and I was going to kind of leave it alone. But I found that, you know, some of the topics that I'm going to talk about on my channel might not be for the faint of heart and it might ruffle a, a few feathers. But I still have to be true to myself. You know, it is my opinion after all. And um, so the blog that I wrote about a year ago, this man accused me of being entitled. And I was pretty much ticked off because that was not the um, the reason for that blog. And if he had taken the time to actually read the blog, he would see that I was, um, in a sense, scolding women because we have to do our parts. Uh, and I'm going to just be very honest. The um, dating world out here today is deplorable. And as I answered yesterday on a social media site, I said, I'm not going to put the blame on the younger generation. I believe it was the generation before mine. And uh, I'm 40 something. And, um, and I, I really do believe that it was the generation right before mine. And I think it started a snowball effect and it started going downhill ever since. And this is what we have today. Men not looking for wives and women not expecting to be wives. And so here's the topic. Why don't men court anymore? And of course, you're going to find men that do still court. We're not talking about every last single man, but there, there are a lot of women out here who are forever asking this question. So apparently it is an uh, issue for some women. And as I've mentioned many times over online, I've said, what incentive do men have today to actually court a woman? A man can go to a club, a bar, walking down the street, and he can have that, a woman that he just met in a bed with him that night or minutes later. True story. I've known women like that. And they're the biggest ones, and they're the main ones talking about all men are dogs. Men aren't being dogs by themselves. There are a lot of women who are helping them and willingly helping them to be dogs. So, okay, so you have women who will shack up with them, have their children out of wedlock, friends with benefits, he my friend, you know, a girl, I need my back blew out, et cetera, et cetera. Sex is important. I'm not saying sex is not important. But when men have it anywhere, anytime they want, there's really no incentive for them to actually court a woman when there are women who are willing to let a man just crash at her place and watch a Netflix movie, order pizza, drink beer maybe. You know, so women, and I'm not talking to all women, some women are fine with that. But for the ones of you who actually want to be courted, courted with the express purpose of being married, the best way to weed out these men that just want to just either sex you over or just come to your place and crash, you know, let him know what your standards are up, up front. And I promise you, you're going to be a novelty. And the thing is, that novelty for some of these men who are just looking for a cheap thrill, it's going to eventually just wear off and he's going to go to his to the next woman who's going to let him do whatever he wants. So uh, I often say that, you know, women today and men come a dime a dozen. There's nobody out here. And yes, it is people out here. And actually, they're um, the more, they're the victims, actually, of this dating arena. Because if you have standards and you actually want to be a wife and you're not adding to the uh, free sex that's flowing all over the place, you're, gonna, you're the one that's going to kind of suffer. 
And, um, you know, I married much later in life. And when I've heard people at work talking about what's going on out here as far as dating and what men expect, men, they expect you to let them just come to your place. Don't even ask you for a date at all. Hey, can I come over? No, you cannot. And believe me, that, that man will go on his merry way because he didn't have your best interest at heart. So men are not really courting the way our father's generation did, the way our grandfather's generation did, because there's no incentive for them to do that. So um, again, I will provide some uh, the link to the blog that I wrote about why men do not court anymore. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.